going on YouTube, Gs right here. So in today's video we're discussing about a brand new spin-off of Dopamine Jailbreak called Shinamine, which is essentially Shina A15 combined with Dopamine. The reason we have this kind of stuff is because Shina A15 uses some stuff that makes it more compatible with older unupdated rootful tweaks. So essentially what they did here was to combine it with that to get those tweaks even on Dopamine. This video is brought to you by Tenorshare Reboot, a software that allows to repair your iOS system if it's broken, no longer booting, or it's stuck in recovery mode, DFU mode, and stuff like that. Definitely check the program out in the link below. A free trial is available for both Windows and Mac OS. So I did post an article about Shinamine Jailbreak, which is essentially dopamine combined with Shina A15 for iOS 15.0 up to 16.5.1, depending on the device. And yes, it does support newer devices, A12 through A15, M1 devices, stuff like that. And you can actually find it. It's completely open source. There's this one over here. And as I said, it is in fact dopamine combined with Shina, so you should still be able to run anything that dopamine can run. Now, this is the official website shina.sipon.xyz, but the jailbreak itself, the combination between uh, dopamine and Shina, is actually open source. Now, I do have this jailbreak already installed over here. You can install it with Troll Store or you can sideload it with Alt Store or Sideload Lane. Once you open it, it looks like this. And yeah, it's essentially that just dopamine, just modified a little bit. You go here to settings and here you can actually enable the parts that are taken from Shina A15. So you have in here remove jailbreak, you have I download, you have tweak injection that you can enable. And then of course you have the theme. If you want to make it look like normal dopamine, you can still do that and it will look like normal dopamine. Now what this does essentially, how this works is by copying the symbolic links from Shina A15 jailbreak. That's what's different on the jailbreak that makes it work with rootful tweaks. And because of those symbolic links, older tweaks, rootful tweaks that have not been updated for rootless format may work with your jailbreak if you have those symbolic links. And not all of them work, of course, but many of them do. So that's why Shinamine exists, in order to bring those symbolic links to dopamine and bring more support for older not updated tweaks. So if you have tweaks that are not updated for the rootless format, but you would definitely want to use them, this should allow you to essentially do just that. So yeah, that's basically it. Definitely check it out. It does support the same iOS versions that Dopamine supports, and it's completely open source. If you do not trust the website or you do not trust the pre-compiled IPA, you can go ahead and just compile it from source code in here. I have a full guide on how to use this and the compatible devices and stuff like that here on my website. So definitely check it out in the link below. Thank you for watching. I am GS Now. Till the next time, peace out.